In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Rock R3 Pro onto the DJI M300 and also the DJI M350 drones. Let's get into it. So here I got the Rock R3 Pro. Let's go ahead and open that up. And here you can see inside the box, we got the R3 Pro, we got the lever arm attachment and the GPS. So let's go ahead and start by putting on the lever arm onto the R3 Pro before we get it out of the box. So I'm gonna line that up, tighten that down like so. That looks tight. Now we can pull it out of the box. So now here's a few things I wanna tell you about before you put on the drone, you can take a look at to make sure everything looks good. So I'm gonna pop off the lens cap. I'm gonna take a look at the lens of the LiDAR. So this is a 360 degree lens and I wanna make sure it's clean. So if there's any debris on it, what I'll first do is I actually have one of these blowers and you can just blow off any dust. So make sure it's clean. And if there's smudges on it, maybe your fingerprints or something, what you can use is one of these lens cleaning wipes. I think this is, uh, what is this? Isopropyl lens, isopropyl alcohol. So this is alcohol wipes and you can wipe that on there. And likewise, I'm gonna do the same thing to the camera lens here on the, uh, the camera, this 26 megapixel camera. So once I verify that that both looks clean, I'm also gonna check to make sure the camera is securely attached. So just check both of these screws and you don't have to torque it down, just needs to be hand tight. And as long as that looks good, then we're ready to put it on the drone. So I'm gonna take off this and show the sky port. And let's go ahead and attach it to the drone now. I'm gonna come over here, we zoom in. We're gonna be able to see there's a uh, white dot on the R3 Pro and there's a red dot here on the drone. Just line those two up like so. And then you twist. Oh, like so, and twist, and there you go. Now the red dots are lined up and it's attached. So now we can go ahead and install the GPS. So I got that here in the box and has screws and threads. And we could put that right on to the side. Just do this gently, make sure it's seated in there. I do like a little twist on the actual mast here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and screw it down securely. So now we've installed the R3 Pro onto the DJI M300 drone. It's the exact same for the M350. Uh, we have the USB to store the data on there. The lenses are clean and everything looks secure. I did my pre-flight checklist on the drone already, but I'm also looking at these, these vibration isolator balls, make sure they look good, nothing's wrong with them. Uh, Cause usually you won't see that until you put some weight on there. And now that there's some weight, we're gonna be able to see, do they look good? So at this point, we've installed the R3 onto the M300 drone. And I'll see you on the next video.